You'll probably remember in the last episode, I mentioned that Allie, one of our Silver Lace Wyandots, was expecting to become a mother after Azula earlier this summer. And not long after, after a few weeks of waiting, we found the first chick. This clip was taken a month before the video's release, and already there are two chicks hatched already. The one you see there, and the other one is right under Ali hiding, because she was probably born earlier that morning. The one you see right now was born the night before. We found the first chick the night before this clip was recorded, when we were putting up the chickens for the night and it was still wet as if it had just hatched maybe a few minutes before we found it. One thing to know about Ali regarding her as a mother, she is not as good of a mother as Azula was before. Not long after the first two were hatched, number three entered the picture, until by Wednesday, we now had five chicks under Ali's care. But we wound up losing one when the older chickens got to it. And we wasted no time moving her and the remaining four to the baby coop. But, by the next week, we were left with only three chicks left. And as they got older, it was time to let them out into the run with their mother. mentioned before, Ali is not the most attendant mother. Unlike Azula, who would keep a constant vigilance on all her chicks, Ali is more than happy to let them be on her own, even before they're old enough to do so. One hour later. Is our our second second classified male in the whole whole batch of nine that we hatched this May. The other one is named RJ. There he goes. And you can see Pepper growing like a weed right there.
Well, that's it for this video. Please remember to leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you on the next video. See you next time!